So Toyota is really focused on electrified and going beyond zero. And that is why Toyota now offers America's largest lineup of electrified vehicles. Now more than ever, there is a push for less carbon footprint. We know that we have to take care of our environment. And I know that Toyota has led the automotive industry many years ago with its introduction of the Prius and is now taking charge once again um, in its push for electrification and beyond zero initiative. And that's what we're going to be talking about today in our SoCal Toyota segment here on the show, together with product specialist Ali Kay. Hello, welcome to the show once again. Hi, thanks for having me. Ali, today let's talk about Toyota's push for electrification. What can you tell us about that? Well, you know what? Toyota does have a huge push for electrification right now. And like you had mentioned too, this all started with the Prius, right? We were the inventors of this hybrid technology and we've seen it grow throughout the years as well. But now with our new initiative, so Toyota is really focused on electrified and going beyond zero. Now that all comes from something uh, which is our full EV vehicle, the BZ4X. Now yes. BZ actually stands for beyond, beyond zero, zero, like you know. Yes. Um, and Toyota's mission is really to go carbon neutral. Right. And we want to be able to cater to every every single type of consumer, which is why electrified is really the mission and the message for Toyota. And Toyota is also giving consumers many choices when it comes to those like uh, being uh, environment conscious, being carbon neutral, and it depends on you, the consumer, on how zero you want it to be or how carbon neutral you want to be. Exactly, yeah. that's right. And we really saw the push with this when the Tundra was redesigned and it came out with that hybrid technology. So we have a number of vehicles from hybrids to plug-in hybrids to full EV vehicles to our hydrogen fuel cell, the Toyota Mirai. So there is something for everyone. Of course, we want fuel efficiency more than anything, which you're going to see that, especially in the new Prius with that redesign up to 57 miles per gallon. So it's really impressive. And like we said, there really is going to be some sort of vehicle for everyone, whether it's an SUV, whether it's a truck, whether it's a sedan or even a crossover. When you say fuel efficient, some people worry about the capability and the power. Tell us about that. Is it being compromised? Not at all. In fact, I feel like it's actually the opposite. You're going to be gaining power and you're going to be gaining torque. Even the Sequoia and the Tundra, when those were designed with that iForce Max technology, it is a V6 engine, but you're going to get a lot more horsepower, a lot more power in the vehicle. Everything's up as far as MPG, towing, you know, torque and horsepower, but you're gonna see that continue within a lot of the Toyota lineup vehicles going into those hybrid technologies and EV routes even too. And we like these choices that Toyota is offering the consumers because every Toyota model fits into whatever lifestyle, right? I remember I have changed Toyota cars as my lifestyle has changed from a single woman to a mom, to a mom of one and pregnant with my second one. I've gone from the Prius to the Highlander and it's just it's just amazing the choices that Toyota gives us. And now there's even more, another layer to it, which is carbon neutrality. Exactly, yeah, yeah it really has been great to see and, and, and to see the growth. But what's even great is that you're seeing these large vehicles available in that hybrid technology. And then even like the RAV4 is available in that plug-in hybrid so you're getting that full ev experience but you're also able to you know go back to that hybrid technology fuel with gas meet in the middle i think really toyota is meeting consumers right in the middle right and the only choice that toyota isn't giving us is when it comes to safety when it comes to durability when it comes to technology because for sure toyota there's no choices it's just up to the high level and Toyota really, we pride ourselves on our safety and technology. And I think that we've continued to see the growth of that throughout the years. Now going into this next year, well, 2023 into 2024, you'll see a lot of the vehicles come standard with Toyota Safety Sense 3.0, which right. is gonna give you a plethora of, uh, of amenities as far as safety goes, um, including a new one, which is called Traffic Jam Assist. Ooh, so that's new, tell us so about you, that. So you drive in traffic a lot, right. I'm sure all of us here in Southern California. Yes. So this is gonna be a really great feature um, because it will actually take over the steering and the driving and the braking and accelerating but it's at under 25 miles per hour right. so it's going to keep you in that traffic jam situation following the cars in front of you as well so it's kind of a neat feature um you know going at a lower speed of course but you're going to start to see that implemented in toyota safety sense 3.0 in some of our vehicles right and that is what toyota is known for especially among filipino viewers and filipino consumers you know the durability the safety the reliability and now carbon neutrality thank you so much for joining us today and explaining to us uh, Toyota's push for electrification and beyond zero. Thanks so much for having me.